Welcome to this review of Ubuntu 11.10. Just for everybody to know, I had a previous video on 11.04 six months ago and it's available right now. Uh, this video is going to be shorter than that one because I will be showing the minor changes and the biggest changes in 11.10. So, to start off with, after you're done watching that video if you want, but this video will show you more often of what everything is new. So, to start it off is the login screen. It has changed drastically. It is far more better than the previous releases of Ubuntu. It's prettier and stable and a little bit quicker. Um, so, the stability of it is very nice. Um, it catches a lot of people's eyes, eye candy. So, next thing is the dash and the launcher. They've enhanced it and made it more polished. Yes, of course, it's customizable. Um, you can drag out icons as the usual feature. Um, they removed the Applications button here. It used to be Start Menu A. Now they only have the Workspace Switcher, which is default, and you can't take it out. Um, with the Launcher, they changed the Dash Home. Um, they made the button bigger instead of putting it at the top. Instead, the menu bar covers up everything. Um, showing the name of the application you have open it will change of course so with the dash they polished it they has a blur uh, feature with it uh, let's say i open up a folder put it up like that start up the dash it has a blur effect and it looks really good the stability of it um i have a bit of a bug with it it's pretty slow on uh, slower computers but when i press the start menu it has a late lag with it. It's not as quick as the previous one. So I hope they fix that in 12.04. Uh, that's about it with the dash and launcher. They have a few new things, which is considered sort of new. They just organize it far more better. They have the buttons down here. And when you have the buttons, they have this thing called filter results. Um, it's just like when we had the menu bar in 9.10 when they removed GNOME 2. So, uh, that's about it for this one. So that's the dash and the launcher. Next thing is the, the new file browser. If you don't know what that is, it is basically where you browse through your files. And it uses Natalis. Now they're using GNOME 3 zone. It just looks prettier, that's about it. And yeah, so the third item we will be looking at is the Ubuntu Software Center. They've completely changed it. It looks far more prettier, again. <laughs> But um, it's quicker, has a new look, and they made it more uh, easy for you to look for things. Just, a, just all of the things that are in 11.10 are the eye candy features. So that's pretty much it of 11.10. You can check it out yourself, available at www.umbuntu.com. So these are just the changes in 11.10. It's stable, has new transitions, everything is polished, and 12.04 may bring more. So that's about it, guys. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. Watch that other video of 11.04's review so you can have more of an elaborate, detailed video.